Welcome to Live Shadows channel before anything you subscribe to. It was an ordinary Friday night and I was chatting late into the night with my friend Bradley on a virtual chat room we had just found. He told me and the rest of my chat members on the main page that we had just seen that he can stay up as long as he wants because his parents have the house and travel until the weekend. We stayed there for a few hours and chatted with these random people and had a good time and I realized that Bradley liked a girl. Soon my mother called me and said go to sleep. He didn't send me anything until the next day. When I turned on the computer and went to my chat room, I saw that he was online. He apologized for not answering me last night and said he was busy. First we exchanged news and then he said that he will come to our house soon and said that his work is necessary. I didn't have a problem, but I asked him why don't you wait for your parents to tell you and see them. They might arrive at any moment. He insisted and said that he didn't have time and thur. It was Bradley's parents who had just arrived home and their voices sounded extremely worried. They asked if I know anything about Bradley and where he is. I said don't worry and he is on the way to my house. For a few moments, no sound came from Onor until I heard a deafening scream from Bradley's mother. His father took a deep breath and courageously and with a trembling voice said both sentences that I will never forget. Get out of the house right now. Brida A is here. He is dead. They, as I was slowly approaching the bed, I could hear the damp sound of his footsteps on the floor. I felt my heart in my mouth and I held my breath. Just when I couldn't leave any more than this, my cell phone beeped loudly. He let me know that I had a text message from Bradley's phone and I read it. Where are you? Suddenly the legs stop and stand on the way. Thank you for following, liking and commenting.